Welcome back to Decentralized News. So quick update, crypto exchange Zipmex is said to have suspended withdrawals due to uh, market volatility. The cryptocurrency exchange did say that uh, today they were blocked. Um, you know, they blocked users from taking direct custody of their coins, saying that, you know, the market conditions are volatile. This is obviously coming where a time when the actual market is starting to look like it was somewhat having a bit of a recovery. So not sure what's going on there, Zipmex, due to a combination of uh, circumstances beyond our control, including volatile market conditions and the resulting financial difficulties of our key business partners to maintain the integrity of our platform. We would be posing withdrawals until further notice, the exchange announced on Twitter. So um, several crypto platforms and lending firms, including Celsius Network, Babel Finance, have taken similar steps in recent weeks, uh, sort of blaming the market turbulence and uh, resulting counterparty risk. Earlier this month, Celsius, of course, filed for Chapter 11 bankruptcy protection in the U.S. bankruptcy court of the southern district of the usa and uh, zipmex itself was established in 2018 it offers crypto trading and investment services in thailand indonesia singapore and australia last year the exchange actually raised 41 million with an investment from the bank of ayuja one of thailand's largest banks as of June, Coinbase has actually agreed to make a strategic investment in Zipmex. The Singapore-based entity was working on a Series B funding round to raise its valuation to 400 million. So I'm not sure what's going to happen in this case, seeing as you know, there's been rumors that Coinbase itself has not been doing particularly well. And I'm not sure if uh, the bank in Thailand would be willing to step in to try to uh, sort of uh, see what's going on and help with that. But I don't know how they'd be able to help with that, considering this is obviously a cryptocurrency firm. So, I mean, again, uh, it seems like the unwinding is uh, continuing to take place. So uh, maybe now because there's uh, trading volumes and uh, there's more market activity, there's still some uh, exchanges uh, that are uh, in uh, sort of a, um, a bit exposure. And I think we're still going to continue to see uh, some of these things um, continue to unfold. I hope if you... Uh, you know, one of uh, uh, the crypto users out there, you do not have your money stuck on Zipmex. Even with everything that's going on, I think it is just safe to say that uh, money should be not kept on these uh, centralized platforms if you can help it. But uh, of course, I'm not a uh, advisor of any sort. But uh, I wouldn't be surprised if we see uh, many, many, many more of these stories. I've been bringing a lot of these uh, stories to you about uh, all that's been going on so i hope uh, you guys are okay and if you caught out in this whole saga then uh, my heart goes out to you but uh, like share subscribe turn on the notification bell always bringing you the best and the latest in blockchain and digital assets peace